Welcome everyone. This is Reverend Terry Newland of TerryNewland.com. This is the spirituality article information for the week of September 24, 2009. It is a channeled message from Ascended Master Dwal Kool. I've been working with him since 1980. There are more free spirituality articles online and they are also available in French, German, and Spanish. And now here is Dwal Kool's latest mes message. <laughs> He's already coming in. <clears throat> Dwal Kool here, Tashi Delay. All right, <clears throat> we have a fall equinox upon us. Uh, we have uh, many energies occurring in this short kind of time frame, <clears throat> including Mercury going direct next week. So what I want to work upon right now is being in the flow of creation. And this is an exercise that I gave during the uh, last um, seminar in, in much more detail. That was the Financial Reorganization and Balance uh, uh, seminar if you want to study up on it a little bit more. But we want the flow of creation to be running through the consciousness at all times. And truly it does. However, there are times when one can you know, perceive that they're separate or they deliberately you know, deflect the energy for a while uh, while they you know, process something or feel an emotion or maybe even um, complain a bit about how creation is going. So as a powerful co-creator, as one who is never separate from creation, uh, is important to remember that the oneness is all-inclusive, that you and creator are one and the same, and that others uh, perhaps are also one and the same. And to expand into that reality, a very simple technique can be used of imagining that the universe is coming towards you, flowing directly through your head and out the back. And you can work with the visual uh, image of um, you know, a spaceship jumping to warp speed is a common one. Uh, some of the vortex screensavers or others, uh, mandalas sometimes can uh, bring you into that reality as well. So I would encourage you to uh, feel that flow of creation just going right through the head and out the back in a continuous stream and keep practicing that. Pardon, we were uh, channel was kissing the cat, and I do believe we have a few um, cat hairs flying around or tickling here in some way. And uh, the cat involved is Rainbow. It's one of her uh, favorite activities. All right, then. Uh, as always, thank you and my love to you.